Hi guys, it's Archie Luxury, and today, guys, we are on the Paul Pluto channel. We're doing a paid review, paid review 24 QA20, and this is a six piece, six piece, six piece collection. Let's run the intro and let's discuss it. Run the intro, big boy. Come on. <laughs> Hi guys, it's Archie Luxury on the Arch. No, it's on the Paul Pluto channel. We're doing quality paid reviews, poopers. Quality paid reviews, 24 QA20. What am I wearing today? I'm wearing my Zenith, the open heart, the gunshot wound Zenith. It's one of my favorite, one of my favorite watches. It's just a watch that, you know, I didn't buy it for other people. I bought it for me, myself, and I. Cheers, fucker Roonies. Cheers, fucker Roonies. Okie dokie. Let's get straight in. Now, this guy here sent me a an, an email with an EML attachment. I don't know what the fuck it, it's some sort of um it's some sort of uh, attachment for it's some sort of attachment for your Outlook, but I don't use out I use web different type of anyhow. Not to worry, he sent me some details which is what we want because we want to go through this collection and have a talk about what he's got <laughs> and what he's he's uh he's doing there uh okay so 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 what's he got let's have a talk about this because the big thing is i gotta be totally honest with you i like these smaller collections the reason i like him is you gotta put more thought into them see when you have a big collection you can you can sort of it's the scatter gun. You can fire the gun into the herd, and you're going to catch something, right? But when you've got a smaller collection, you've really got to think about it. You don't have that um, <clears throat> that freedom, that freedom. Um, so it it really is important that you you think about what you're adding, what pieces you have. Now we're going to go through the pieces, and then we're going to see. Now, the way he sent this email is absolute garbage because what does he fucking do? He sends me an EML attachment. I don't use Outlook type server. I use web-based hosting. I use, I'm a Google man. So it doesn't really interfa interface with my Gmail easily. I don't use pop servers because I need to be on the go. I'm, 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 I'm mobile. So that was a fucking, I, 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 don't, I don't like opening those sort of attachments either. Six pieces, what has he got? Now, this is where it gets annoying because he didn't give me any background. I normally like a background story. Why does he have this? Why does he have that? I want to know the story. And uh, he sent me these images, and guess what? Some of them are fucking blurry. They're not really great images, okay? They're not fantastic. Um, it's actually pretty crappy how he's done this which is a shame because i like to put extra effort into these reviews because they they mean a lot to me okay so let's let's go through the list so the fuck that's hopeless okay we're going the first one he's got is his sky dweller great choice great choice of watch there Let's bring it up. What's he? Oh, fuck me dead. You, you know, this is just shit. The way he sent it to me is just garbage. But anyhow, let's just, let's not argue. Let's just get this fucking thing on the screen. Okay. So we save it. Save as copy. Okay. There we go. It's done. I'm just mucking around. He's 
fuck me dead you know just send me jpegs i want a thousand and 24 by 768 that's the best fucking resolution okay here we go this is the this is the first one so it's a two-tone black dial reference 326933 it's on the oyster bracelet black dial it's what do you say absolutely beautiful beautiful watch i love this watch i owned one white dial very sad stolen in the burglary very sad indeed I would definitely get a Sky Dweller again. I think they're amazing. They're really special watches, in my opinion. Yes, they are. They're very special. Um, um, I got to be totally honest with you. It's a beautiful watch. I really love it. Um, nothing, nothing, nothing wrong with this watch. Um, beautiful. It's a beautiful watch. Um, gorgeous. I don't have a problem with that. Now, the next piece he's got is a... Oops, what the hell is that? Uh, what the fuck? Sorry, I'm just, I just losing this image here. Next piece is the Aquaterra Omega Aqua. Sorry, just calling up the wrong piece there. Just sorry, I don't know why it's come brought that up. Um, this is the Aquaterra. Great piece. Great piece. This is an Omega Aquaterra. Um, great watch. Great watch. Um Great watch, steel, grayish, bluish dial. Omega Aquaterra, it's got a number like a fucking phone number. What the fuck does that mean? I mean, who gives a fuck? It's on a bracelet. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful Omega. Well, it's gorgeous, gorgeous. I like it. I approve. Tick. Next, we've got a Pam Lumina Pam 914. Oh, shit. This is not the one I wanted. Uh, where is it? Nine one four. Here we go. This is the Pam. What do you think of the Pam? Um, what do I think of the Pam? The Pam is amazing. Um, the Pam is amazing. It is a great watch. It is a great watch. The Pam is amazing. A nine one five. I'm. What do I think? It's an eight day. You can see eight giro. I love the Italian on it. Yeah. Um, nice watch. Nice watch. Nice watch. Pam Lumina. Beautiful. You steel stunner. I love Pam on the rubber, 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 rubber. What 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 more do you want to know? Um, I mean, Pam. What what can I say about it? It's manual wine, uses the caliber five thousand. Um, I think it's 44 mils, 44 mil classic size. It's the Lumina. It's got the classic, you know, that crown guard thing there, how it, the winder is. It's just a classic gorgeous Pam. What, what more do you want? You can fuck around with straps. You can do whatever you want with this baby. Good choice. You don't need any more Pams. You got enough. One's enough. But hey, beautiful watch. Next one, I'm going to find is an IWC. Terrible photo at a bit of, well, it actually doesn't look too bad on the screen here. Uh, it's an IWC pilot chronograph reference 388101. So it's a day date chronograph. Yeah, <laughs> this is nice. Nice, nice, nice steel IWC. It's not the greatest. I mean, I prefer a gold Breguet personally, but. It's it's an IWC. It's what they do well. Pilot watches. Then we have. Then we have. Then we have. Then we have. Oops, sorry, sorry. There's. Uh, we have an. What do we have here? A Rolex Submariner Data Sermit reference one two six six one zero LV. Look at this beautiful. Absolutely fucking beautiful. <clears throat> beautiful watch. 
And finally, in the six-piece combo meal deal, Hunger Buster. The Hunger Buster. What have we got in the Hunger Buster? We have got a Cartier Santos. Cartier, Cartier Santos. Absolutely beautiful. Large reference WSSA0018. I don't know what the fuck these numbers mean with Cartier. Who cares? Cartier is such a fickle fashion fucker. But I, what I love about this Cartier is gone for the white dial, the classic. You could go blue, you could go green, but this is classic. It'll never get, it's just classic Cartier Santos. Beautiful. I actually like it, which is unusual because I despise Cartier at time. Bunch of fucking cynical cunts. I, but cynical cunt I am. But yeah, so what do I think here? Six piece. Let's have a look. We've got our bases covered. I always look at our bases. We got a diver. Well, we got a few divers. We've got a submariner sermit. We've got a Pam915. So we've got divers. Then we look at chronographs. What have we got in chronographs? In chronographs, we've got an IWC pilot. Okay. And then in GMTs, what do we got? GMTs, we've got a, well, the Sky Dweller is a GMT. It's not a perfect GMT. So what I would say is, then we look at smart businessman watch. We've got the, the Sky Dweller. We've got the Aquaterra. It's a smart, everyday, casual, upmarket watch. What I'd really say we're missing, personally, if it was me, I would be adding, I would be adding a GMT, like a, you could add a Tudor, Tudor GMT, Tudor, Pepsi, white dial, or, you know, you could add it, or, or a Black Bay Pro. Yes, I'd prefer to add an explorer too. That'd be the way I'd go. I'd go black dial against the grain. Uh, and I think the other thing we would add as well would be we need to add the gold fuck off dress slash sports watch. So when I say dress slash sports, in my collection, I've gone for a Breguet Type 21, solid rose gold on a leather strap. So it's kind of a dress watch, but it's a sports watch. You know what I mean? It's yin and yang, fuckers. We need a gold fuck off statement watch. That's what we need. Is the Sky Dweller? Well, it's two-tone. I don't think it's fuck off enough. And I love two-tone. I got a bluesy. I love my bluesy. But it's not trying to be my statement fuck off piece. So I think that's something I would aim to add. What would I add? Uh, we could add a paddock. We could add a VC. We could add a number of fucking amazing pieces. The important thing is we don't sit on our fucking lazy ass and do nothing. So that's my advice. Is it a great collection? Is it a good collection? Is it lousy? What do I think? I like it. I like it. I really like it. I would just say to make it a great, extraordinary collection, I'd be adding... A GMT, preferably Rolex. I would be adding a gold fuck off dress watch. That's what I'd do. Rose gold or yellow gold. That's what I'd do. That's to bring it to the next tier of greatness. Now, whether you like, want to do that or don't, that's up to you. But I've given you the ruling. It's a nice collection. I like it. I like it. A lot of thought. I like these compact collections. And the best thing is, too, six piece. I'd go out and get a boisterous, boisterous watch box. No, they're not sponsoring me. I'm just telling you, honestly, I'd go and get myself a six piece combo meal deal hunger buster. I'd get one of these boxes. That's what I do. Get a box. Get a box. Put it into a nice, good box. Not a cheap fucking Amazon box. I hate those fucking cheap Amazon sort of boxes. They just give me the shit. A quality box. A box. That's what I always like. A box. I'm Archie Luxury. Remember, paid reviews keep me on YouTube. Without your support, I can't survive. I'm in a small niche. Not a lot of viewers. All the hypesters have gone. They're gone. It's just the true collectors. I need your help.
get a paid review. 50 US dollars is the base. You can tip a little bit more or you don't have to. It's no problem. Guys, help me out. I can't survive without your help. Details below. Get it done. Tell me the story. I'll tell you what I think. I'm Archie Luxury, and I will see you in the next one. And if you're buying or selling a watch in America, who do I recommend? It's David SW. Hi, guys. It's Archie Luxury. Guys, I want to talk to you about David SW. David SW, David SW. Guys, if you are in America, if you are looking for a Rolex watch of your dreams, in fact, if you're looking for a contemporary modern wristwatch, I strongly advise you to look at David SW. Guys, don't play the dealer games. Don't bring in chocolates or crispy creams for your dealer hoping to get a Rolex at retail. It's futile. Please, guys, save your dignity. Keep some pride. Go to David SW. I would highly recommend David SW, David SW. If you're in America and you're looking for a watch, go to David SW, David SW, David SW. That's right, guys. David SW. David SW, fuckers. That's where I'd go. David S.